Welcome to the registration portion of your online student orientation. Before you register, you'll need to obtain your student ID, which you'll use to set up your Palo Verde College Services online account. With PVC Services, you'll be able to register and pay for classes, view your grades, check your financial aid status, and view and print an unofficial transcript. If you have met with a counselor to develop an education plan, you may be eligible for priority registration status. This will help ensure that you get into all the classes that you need before they all fill up. This system is in place to ensure that students who are making progress towards their goals are rewarded for their efforts. Students who complete assessment, orientation, and an ed plan will be eligible for priority registration status. To keep this status, you must maintain a GPA of at least 2.0 and complete at least 50% of all the courses that you have enrolled in for each term. Priority registration status is also only for students who have less than 100 accumulated units. Don't forget to refer to your education plan when registering for your classes. Make sure that you're familiar with prerequisites and co-requisites. A prerequisite is a course, assessment, license, or process that must be completed prior to enrolling for another course. For example, Math 101 must be completed before enrolling in Math 105. Math 101 is the prerequisite to Math 105. A co-requisite is a course that must be completed at the same time as another companion course. For example, Bio Lab must be completed within the same term as Bio 101. These are co-requisite courses. Make sure to budget your time wisely when choosing your class schedule. Each course has a unit value based on the number of class hours per week. For example, a three-unit course will require three hours spent in class every week. It is also expected that every unit will require an additional two hours of homework or studying outside of the classroom. So what will this look like? Let's say you take 12 units during a semester. That means you will spend 12 hours per week in your classes and 24 to 36 hours per week doing homework and studying. Consider carefully the amount you take on when registering for your classes. It's not uncommon for new students to take more than they can handle and find themselves overwhelmed. We recommend that you do not wait to take your foundational classes like English, math, and reading. There will be a number of exciting classes that you'll want to take right away, but Palo Verde's most successful students complete their English, math, and reading courses first. These foundational classes will give you the critical thinking skills necessary for you to become a successful learner in all of your other classes. There are four types of instruction to be aware of that will classify the different courses. A face-to-face -face course is the traditional classroom setting that you're accustomed to with an assigned room and meet time. PVC offers courses in multiple cities, so make sure you know the location of your classes. ITV, or Interactive TV, is a course that takes place simultaneously in two separate classrooms. The class instructor may be at either location, and their lecture is broadcast at the same time to the other classroom. Students from Blythe or Needles may register for these classes. Correspondence classes are taken separately from a classroom and instructor setting. You will receive your materials, exercises, and exams from the correspondence office, by mail, or by email, and you will return them for grading and credit. Correspondence classes are typically self-paced, but there will always be deadlines you must adhere to. The last class setting you'll find are the online courses. All of the materials, lessons, and exams take place on the web through a service called The Bridge, found on the PVC website. Once you have registered for your classes, be sure to submit your tuition fees. If you have an outstanding balance, you won't be able to register for the next term or obtain an official transcript until that balance is paid in full. Once you know what courses you'll be taking, you'll want to get your textbooks. You can rent or purchase any of your required texts through the PVC Virtual Bookstore on the PVC website. And if you'd like, at the end of the term, you can check back to see if your books can be sold back through the college website. 
As always, just contact one of your counselors if you have any questions about courses or your registration.